what's up today today i have a very very special treat for you all we have lots of good content coming your way uh today our designer of the day is super special so i'm just i'm really excited i don't know why i'm jumping ahead of myself i just really want to get to it it's really nice oh okay so already this person has a bunch of cool designs i love the sand sculptures um but yeah so this look oh my god the first three things that they made is the umbrella academy Stuff. So this is like a general sweater, which I really like. I'm going to be saving this one. And then there's the Umbrella Academy in the dress form. Oh my god, favorite just for this already. I don't know if you guys have been watching the Umbrella Academy, but it's definitely probably my favorite show right now. I'm kind of obsessed with it. And then they have the Umbrella Academy in just the shirt form. You could probably wear like shorts with it. Look like number five a little bit. This is Kat from Whimsy, and this is their creator code. If you want to check out their designs, I think they're super talented. They seem to have a lot of cool stuff going on. Lots of cool references. They have a really cool taste in uh, shows and games. Oh my God, I totally forgot the most important part is my hair. Um, I'm going to try to look like um, Allison. I think she's one of the cooler characters. I really like her story arc and how it's going in uh, season two. I know her hair was like kind of like down and wavy. So we're going to do as much, you know, as true to character as possible. I wish we had more curls and stuff. It would be nice. <laughs> there we go. Oh my God. We look so much like them. So for today's island, we're going to go a little bit more urban. I thought, you know, I've never really, you know, had the guts to try out the urban style myself in Animal Crossing where it looks like an actual city. So I wanted to check out one of those today, especially since we're dressed as the Umbrella Academy. Might as well go with something like a city. And then tomorrow we're going to do something a little bit quite the opposite, actually, of what we're doing today. Very whimsical, very pastel-y, dreamlike, pink. Uh, so that's going to be fun. Stay tuned for that. That will be up tomorrow around the same time as this video. So this is the dream address. If you want to check them out and do it with me. We can we can we can tour this together. It's called Loon Apple. Of course, another reminder that you cannot do this if you don't have the monthly subscription to I think Nintendo Membership Plus or something, something like that. One of those things. Um, so definitely make sure that you get that. I know that if you do like a family plan, you can get a couple of your friends to go on it. I do the family plan for me and my sister, so definitely check and see if you could do that. Okay, this is another thing that I really like is that going to other people's islands gives me the opportunity opportunity to see different versions of items like i didn't know that could be black and white so we have a little road here i love how these make everything look like the two vending machines really nicely placed wow look at this level of detail the menu boards especially make it look really super realistic oh my lord hello that pe that thing with red uh, berries on it how do i get that i need that oh my god i didn't know these cool plants existed oh wow i'm just so shocked the level of detail put into this this must have taken forever oh my gosh i like how they have the the two different types of stones next to each other so it looks like you know you're walking on on it oh i love the the icicle and the oh my god the sakura pots that's so nice hello is this the person i a star in the sky oh she's so cute <laughs> I don't want to check out her house just yet, so we're going to do that last. <gasps> Hello, it's Flurry. Please love me. Please let me steal you. Oh, her catchphrase is baby. That's so cute. Wow. So lovely. So nice. Um, oh, oh my God. Hey, look, a picnic spot. Another one. It's a little park. I love the weeds and how it like makes everything look so real. It's crazy. <gasps> oh, it's like a lavender field. So pretty and like the hills have like different types of heist and stuff there. That's so nice. Wow, the purple ones, they kind of look better than the pink ones. Not gonna lie, I think I have a new favorite type of hyacinth. Hmm, there you go. Ooh, is this a diagonal bridge? I think it is. I've never seen one of these before. Hmm, that's so cool. Kind of makes me want to implement that into uh into my island. Hmm, thinking about stuff. Oh, you can go down here and wait for red. I don't think there's anything else down here, though. So, yeah, that's it. I don't really have an entrance for red. I kind of just ignore him. Ooh, whose house is this? Is this Marshall or Raymond? This is Marshall's house. Okay, so I'm really glad because Marshall 
and uh, Flurry have the type of house that I want all my villagers to have, which is like this kind of like cone shaped roof. It's so cute. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with it. Oh, I like this pool. Yeah, wow. Like props to this person for putting in the work. Like this obviously took a lot of time. I think down here is probably just gonna lead us. <gasps> oh my lord. Is how does a bear get that big? That's crazy. Wow, they like won. They just won all the bears. That's crazy. Let's make our way back down. Or okay, this is where it goes to the welcome. Okay, got you. I got you. Oh my god, Meringue and Marshall have a little walk together in their dreams. I love you. I love you both. Please be with me. All right, for the grand finale, we check out their house, which looks really pleasing, aesthetically pleasing. I like the lights on the side. Ooh, <gasps> whoa, look at this star rug. I love that. Wow, it's so nice in here. Oh, they have a little workout station going on here. That's cute. There's a lot of cool items in here. Um, which way do we go first? Mm, I'm gonna go left or right, left or right. I'm gonna go left. You know, unexpected. Read it like a book. <gasps> this is the cutest! Oh my god, they have magazines. It looks like, um, Japanese magazines or something. I'm not quite sure. This is so cute! Oh yeah, I forgot that we can move around in the room. Ooh, they have, like, their mom's little thingy there, like mine. Wow, I wonder if they do they have anybody's like best friend portrait. I do see a couple of people like I see Lolly, Marshall. They have a couple of people with posters. Um, oh, these mom. She has like two mom pillows. That's cool. Wow, neat old room. And let's go to the top. I really hope they did like a bathroom or um, a kitchen. I would love to see their rendition of it. That'd be nice another bedroom oh my gosh so cute oh i love that dress oh this must be them in the picture there that's cool they must have like digitized their own photo and stuff oh and i love like the the implementation of like the butterfly plaque with the butterfly wall very nice and also the hanging dried roses nice touch that's i think that's my favorite one so far that's if i had a room it would mostly look like that one so far maybe they're all just rooms she says like a bunch of people living in her house or maybe she sleeps she has like three different rooms that's fine okay so this one's a bear one <laughs> it kind of seems like maybe this might be another room or maybe like a wedding space i don't know i know that that's the type of wallpaper that i have for my room so possibly another room i find that people usually put like their favorite room at the top oh nothing in here maybe she might still be working on these rooms obviously it takes a lot of planning and a lot of time because they look phenomenal when they're finished <gasps> Ooh, whoa that's so cool nice use of the bigger space i like it i see look the city the city highlights skyline i just or wallpaper i love it so much Ooh, the spices and stuff it looks like looks like we're doing something right now that's really cool yeah i like this one I like the, the flooring. I feel like the flooring is really underrated part of the process of like making your room. But like, honestly, it makes a difference. It's like a make it or break it situation. But yeah, this has been their island. I think it was a great island tour to have. Um, I definitely appreciate the uh, the city, the, like the amount of time it takes to make something like this. The city aesthetic is definitely not one for the faint of heart. I like how there's multiple ways to get to the same space. That's really user-friendly thinking, like forward thinking. I love all your villagers. If you ever see this, your villagers are literally so cute. I'm jealous and I want them all. Oh yeah, and don't forget to check out their custom designs. Um, they are some pretty rockin' stuff. And that's gonna be it from me and Allison, I suppose, my character for the day. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!